Hey guys, Johnny here from TechMajesty.com. Today I'll be showing you how to permanently factory unlock your Samsung Galaxy Note 9 step by step using an unlock code. This method will also work to unlock all other Samsung phones as well. We can unlock your phone regardless of any outstanding balances, financing, contracts, blacklist status, etc. The unlock will not affect your warranty, it will increase the resale value of your phone, and you'll be able to use the phone with any GSM carrier of your choice. All you need in order to unlock the phone is an unlock code and a non-allowed SIM card which is basically a SIM card that's not from your original carrier. So let's begin. The first thing we will need is the 15 digit IMEI number which you can get by going to the dialer of the phone and dialing star pound zero six pound. This will give you the 15 digit IMEI. So now that we have the IMEI number of the phone, we will go on the computer and open the internet browser to go to techmajesty.com. Once we are on this website, we will place an order to unlock our phone. We will go to the Samsung Unlock Code section. Then we will choose the Samsung Galaxy Note 9 since that's the phone we're unlocking today. After that, you will choose the carrier your phone is locked to, such as AT&T, Sprint, Boost Mobile, T-Mobile, Metro PCS, Xfinity Mobile, etc. My phone is locked to AT&T, so that's the carrier I'll be choosing. After that, you will enter the 15-digit IMEI number that we got in the beginning of the video. After that, you have these three optional services. The first option is if you'd like to use your phone on Verizon. Second option is for the bloatware removal service, which will remove all carrier branding from your phone and make it into a stock Samsung phone. And then the third option is for express processing to get your unlock done in one to two hours. These are all optional services and you can get them if you'd like. After that, you will click on the add to cart button and go through the checkout process to complete your order. Once you complete the checkout, you'll receive an email within the stated time frame with your phone's unlock code. The email will look like this and say order and closed. The email will contain your unique unlock code and full instructions to complete the unlock. So, now that we have the unlock code, let's move on to entering it into the phone. In order for the unlock prompt to come up, we will insert a non-allowed SIM card into the phone. So let's go ahead and remove the SIM card tray of the phone. My phone is locked to AT&T, so I'm going to be inserting a T-Mobile SIM card into the phone. Here's my T-Mobile SIM. Now, as soon as I insert this SIM tray back into the phone, the phone will ask for the SIM network unlock code. There you go, enter network unlock code. So I'm going to go ahead and enter the unlock code that I received from Tech Majesty. All right, so now that I've entered it, I'm going to go ahead and hit the unlock button. And there you go, network unlock successful. So that means this phone is now permanently factory unlocked. Now we have started receiving signal from T-Mobile as well, as you can see on the top. So guys, it's as easy as that to unlock your phone to use on any GSM carrier of your choice in the US or internationally. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and don't forget to subscribe if this video helped you. Thank you so much for watching.